Do you get an error message like this when trying to load a scenario? And like this? Or a message like this? If so, I have a solution for you. How to remove mod dependencies from a scenario in Arma 3. Today we're going to create a small scenario that will have a couple of mod dependencies. Before we start, I want to show you at the bottom left, I have CBA, Community Upgrade Project Weapons, Cup Units, Cup Vehicles, and Ace 3 loaded as mods. So let's go to the editor. We're going to go to Malden. And then we're going to go to this location. And we're going to build a little scenario. So we're just going to put down a Grenadier from Arma 3 itself. This is a vanilla asset. We're going to go to United States Army, Cars Woodland, and choose this guy. So we have a car. Choose a Black Hawk. Since we have a helipad, we're just going to put him on the helipad. Face him in this direction. We're going to go to Modules. We're going to go to Ace Mission Modules and put Ambient Sounds down. What I want to show you now is if you go to the top left to Scenario and you go down to this area, you're going to see two lines here. It says Show Required Add-ons Open Scenario Folder. Now we're going to be working with those today, but at the moment we haven't saved our mission, so this is not lit. So let's save our mission. Let's save this under Malden, and we're going to name this Cup Mission. Alright, so that's our mission, cupmission.malden. And now if we go back to the Scenario tab, you'll see that these two lines are now lit up. So let's go to the show required add-ons and a dialog window will come up and basically it's going to list everything that is in your mission currently at the top we have armor 3 alpha characters and clothing basically that's a vanilla asset then we have cup military u.s army wheeled vehicles air vehicles so those three are from from the cup mods and then we have a3 mission modules if you go to advanced kind of like the class names. Go back to the scenario and we go down to open scenario folder. We are in the scenario folder cup mission dot Malden. Here is the mission SQM. So if we open up the mission SQM, open up with notepad and you scroll down, you're going to see a line that's titled add-ons. As you've seen in the editor, we have the same information on what's in our mission. So we have A3 characters, that's the Arma 3 vanilla asset. Then we have Cup Military US Army, Cup Wheeled Vehicles, and Cup Air Vehicles, and then of course the Ace Mission Modules. We're going to add one more mod to this, so let's go back to the editor. We're going to add one module, and it's going to be a CBA module. Now we're just going to save it, and let's go to a scenario, and show required add-ons. So now we've added mod dependency, community-based add-ons, module CBA team, and of course it'll show up here as CBA modules. Now if you go into the scenario folder and, and look at the uh, Mission SQM, let's open the Mission SQM and scroll down to the add-ons. We have the ACE modules that we placed and now we just placed a CBA module. So as you can see and understand that any assets that you place in the editor will create a dependency in Mission SQM. In order to remove these, let's say Ace Mission Modules, click highlight it, just hit backspace, and then want to bring the line up. So make sure that everything's got quotes, the commas are where they're supposed to be, and that's it. So the code is fine. Now we just save this, and then we go back to the Mission Editor. Everything's going to be the same if we show required add-ons. Everything's still going to be here, ACE 3, mission modules, etc. But, so here's what you do. If you have your mod still loaded and you want to get rid of ACE, then obviously delete the ACE mission module and then save your mission. If you go to scenarios, 
and show required add-ons, you're going to see that Ace does not show up anymore. If we go back to the Scenario folder, so we're going to go Open Scenario Folder, and we open up the Mission SQM, and we go down, you're going to see that the Ace has been removed because we removed it earlier. By going into the Mission SQM, you're just checking to see that it's not there. Why this lengthy process just to you know, remove something because if you don't want it there, it's ruining your mission or it's causing errors or the mod is missing, then well, this is one way to do it. All right, we're back on the main menu and I want to point out that I restarted the game without the mods. So we're, we don't have any mods, CBA Cup or Ace. And so we're going to go to the editor, we're going to go to, to Malden and we're going to load up our mission. And now I'm going to show you guys what happens. This won't be new to those that are used to editing missions and stuff, but mainly for those new players to the game that are just starting to learn to build their own missions and are working with mods and come across different errors and stuff. This is an error that you may see where it'll show who's loading it, what the mission is, and what mods are missing. If you hit that you'll get this required add-ons box which we seen earlier. We are missing the cup cup and community based add-ons and the one that's checked is the Arma 3 Alpha character's clothing. So basically that's the vanilla Arma 3 soldier that we placed. So what you could do is you can just force load the mission. We're gonna force load this. What's gonna basically happen is everything that you placed before, even our helicopter, has disappeared because there is no mod loaded. There's no models from the mod to load. And all we have left is the first character we, that we placed, which is a vanilla asset. So if we go to scenario and then show required add-ons, which just say, save the scenario, it only has the characters and clothing. Your scenario is free of these add-ons. We're gonna go back there. And that's all you have. And then if you go to open scenarios folder and then you go to the mission SQM and scroll down where the add-ons are, you're going to be left with the vanilla asset. The other thing I want to point out to you guys, if you go to scenario and then open log folder and you go to the RPT, this will be the RPT. You open the RPT and you go towards the bottom, it'll say missing add-ons detect cup creatures, cup air vehicles. CBA modules. So as you can see that those will also be listed there if you happen to look here first. Those are the ways that you can remove mod dependencies from your scenario.